Now these folks are about to get a uh, bonus gun talk live. Like this is a bonus for these these folks. Special occasion. Yeah, it is a special occasion. We've got we've got a big announcement. I hope they're I hope they're starting to tune in. People are starting coming. They're like, holy crap, gun talks live on on Friday. <laughs> on, <laughs> yeah. Hey, wait, three oh, wait. Three thirty. Wait, three thirty, three thirty. What do I got going on three thirty? Oh yeah, it's another break. <laughs> Looking forward to the weekend. <laughs> that's what the, that's what they're looking forward to. But I think I think one of the biggest uh, things that folks are going to actually look into this uh, live, they're going to have questions on how much is it, where can I get it, and what else. Um, what other optics? What other optics run on it? Yeah, yeah. Probably. Oh, hey. You guys are live. You guys are here with us. Okay. Yes. You guys get a bonus. So lucky you. And yes, again, whichever side he usually sits on, he ain't here. It's just me. So we've got big announcements. Actually, we don't have big announcements. We're just sharing it with you. Springfield Armory launches the XDM OSP. Optical system. Oh, wait. Wait. What was it? Optical sight pistol. Optical sight pistol. I've known it as the OSP. Actually, we were fortunate enough to get one in last week, um, and we're going to get to that here in a second, and we're going to unbox it here in a little bit, but I know there's going to be questions about MSRPs, widths, heights, what's it come with. We're going to get into all that, but Springfield Armory, uh, with the launch of the 9mm uh, XDM OSP, has opened up a big market uh, for you know platforms to come. And I know you guys are like, well, why didn't they make it in 40? No, people don't ask that, <laughs> right? <laughs> no, they, you guys are probably going to look for a 45, and who knows? I don't know what Springfield's doing, but they're doing it right with the Springfield XDM OSP. Now, I'm monitoring comments on both uh, YouTube and Facebook, so you're going to have to bear with me a little bit. Um, so I can get your questions answered. Uh, it might take just a second to pull all these videos up. But we want to give you guys kind of a first look at this. We want you guys to ask questions, and if I can't answer them, we'll jump back on and I'll answer them in the comment section. So if you guys have comments, please list them. But without further ado, we took the OSP to the range. Um, it, and I will give my reaction to what happened on the range after the video. So we're going to tune this video up. I'm going to shut my mouth and, well, not really because I'll be talking in the video. So here you go. You guys check it out. Okay, all you Red Dot fans who happen to love the XDM, this might be your next pistol. It's the Springfield Armory XDM OSP. It comes with a threaded barrel. I've taken the thread protector off, put a can on it, and it's ready to run. And yes, it does come with a Vortex Venom if you want. Wow, the XDM bar has been set now with the OSP from Springfield Armory. In fact, it's almost cheap. Well, honestly, there is nothing better to critique your uh, shooting like slow motion video. Uh, and I know you guys probably saw it in there. I kind of came off target just a little bit, but that was my fault. Uh, overall, my initial uh, reaction to the XDM OSP uh, optical sight pistol from Springfield is it's, it's a wonderful gun. If you guys like red dots, if you guys like the XDM platform, you're going to love this gun. Uh, I, I shot it well, um, and honestly, I'm not much of a pistol guy. Um, I'm more of the rifle, uh, you know, bolt action kind of guy, long range, and pistols really aren't my forte, but it handles really nicely. So uh, I'm trying to answer some questions here. Um, 
What's the MSRP? Simon says train. Okay, now it's gonna come in two models. Uh, it's gonna come with one with three uh, site adapter plates um, and a Vortex Venom. That's gonna run you $958 MSRP. The one without the Vortex Venom is going to run you 710 MSRP. So those prices with the Vortex Venom, that's going to be $958 MSRP. The other one, MSRP, is going to be 710 and that is without the Vortex. But either way you go, um, you are going to have three adapter plates uh, come with that gun and they're going to outfit a wide variety of popular optics like your RMRs, your Delta Point Pros. Um, and what's the other last one? The uh, Delta Point Pro, the Delta Point, Delta Point. and the RMR, and the and the Venom. So, so those are really what they are. Uh, and let's look, which optics is it capable? I think I just covered that. Um, but we've got, oh yes, is it good for the self defense in spirit? Yes, it is, because I'm. <laughs> that's a, that's a good comment, right? So, so what we what they've done, what Springfield's done, and I'm gonna unblock it, unlock it, open it up. We're gonna show you guys before I start pulling junk out of here, uh, what you guys got. Um, but it comes with a, a a bunch of stuff. What you're gonna notice is it a great box comes in. See if I can get it lined up here. I'm gonna do my best weatherman impersonation right here. So this is what you got. This is what it's gonna come like. This is what it's gonna look like. Um, now this is obviously the one with the Vortex Venom already mounted. So that's how it comes. We didn't mount that. It comes like that. So that's a big, big uh, deal. Obviously, threaded barrel. Uh, threaded barrel comes on it. Uh, and uh, honestly, honestly, with the threaded barrel, now you're probably not going to carry that. And I know a lot of carry guys are like, well, I don't really want... A threaded barrel when I'm carrying it either appendix or you know on your on your hip or wherever you might be carrying that day uh, but Springfield already thought about that because they also included another barrel non threaded version right here and you will get a good look at that I think it's like 4.3 inches um, but anyway so you're able to switch it out now you can carry the XDM with a red dot and uh, obviously vortex venom is on here comes with two magazines okay it comes with a night two 19 round magazines which is nice also comes with three back straps small medium large um, for you guys that you have heart large hands switch them out not a problem but the big deal is the three adapter plates that come with this um, so if you have one I think you can see kind of an example of one right here but that's going to be crucial for you guys that you don't want to buy this pistol with the Venom red dot. You already got a red dot. Maybe you have an RMR on another gun, but uh, it comes with three adapter plates for any wide range of optics that you want. Uh, so, you know, after shooting this, seeing what, how it handles really good. Uh, I'm going to monitor a few comments real quick. Um, calibers will be available right now. Right now it's only the nine millimeter. So, just look for the nine millimeter right now um, and we've got the website tuned up they've already got it on their site you guys can learn more about it they've got more videos on there so that's great but yeah it's gonna be it's going to be a great concealed carry gun the guys that love the xdm um, platform this is perfect for you um, and i mean you know, Jace, you're out in the out in the world of you know guns and everything like that. I mean, guys, more guys are carrying red dots on yep. their carry pistols, Absolutely. and that's that's huge. That's massive. You know, it already comes with it. What's the weight of the trigger, and what does it feel like? Honestly, it's it's a nice feeling trigger. I have not put a uh, um, a uh, measure to, towards it yet. Um, Honestly, it feels like an XDM, but better. It feels like an XDM trigger. I mean, you shot this a lot, yeah. uh, too, while you're at the range. I mean, it's, pretty slick. it's a pretty slick pistol. Uh, I mean, it, it feels, it runs quick. 
Obviously, Jace runs it a lot faster than I do. Uh, it stays on target, and especially with the with the red dots nowadays, you're able to get on on target quicker. Boom, boom, and so I love it. I mean, I, I think I think they've hit it out of the park with this one. I think you guys are going to really enjoy it. But uh, keep the questions coming in. Um, regular XDM holsters work, or do you need a dedicated holster? Um, I tried it in a regular XDM holster. I thought it fit just fine. Uh, I didn't really feel any resistance as far as um, the red dot was concerned. You'll need a little bit of a cutout, but I was running a, um, outside the waistband, so it gave me a little bit more clearance. Now your, uh, you know your um, concealment holsters, your IWBs, or something like that. Uh, those may you may run into a problem right there but it feels good guys it feels like yeah, it feels like an XDM uh, and a lot of guys a lot of guys notice too they didn't put grip zone so we know we know where we, we still know where to grip the gun but that's a pretty cool deal um, but yeah guys external uh, grip safety it's got all the features you want from an XDM except now threaded barrel um, and we actually shot it with a can on it, and and man, it shot great. It it handles nice. Get a little weight out in front of that gun, can control it real easy. And then after you're done shooting it on the range, swap out those barrels, and you can conceal carry it. But you know, <laughs> Mr. F and Mr. F and H actually loves the grip zone. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I know. I know that that seems to be a point of contention among a lot of Springfield Armory fans. Like they just didn't like it. I didn't have a problem with it. It's just a. It just. You know. It, it just seems like just marketing speak. I, don't, yeah. I mean, that's what it seems like. I mean, we all know where to grip the gun. But I have a question uh, from Ryan: Can I use a threaded barrel in an XDM I already own? I would think so. I would think you could. I haven't tried that. Um, I don't know if the, in I, if the internals have changed I, at all. It does not look like the internals have changed. Um, what, I've, what I've seen as far as taking apart and stuff like that, the internals look the same. Uh, that's a question better answered by the folks at Springfield. Um, consult them because we haven't tried it. Uh, any any more questions on Facebook? Because mine's honestly not pulling up, guys. I apologize if I'm ignoring anybody on Facebook, um, but that's the way it happens. Hey, while we have a little bit of downtime here, um, one of our giveaways is already done, but we've got the Big Buck Down giveaway still. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to our newsletter. Um, what else? Ah, I hear a phone. Who's got their phone on high? <laughs> but you guys... Uh, but anyway, uh, give you guys a few of the details. How much does it weigh? It weighs with the optic 31.1 ounces. Without the optic, it's going to run 29 ounces. So actually not that bad, what you'd expect from an XDM. Um, length, 8.6 inches. Uh, the height is going to be, without the optic, it's going to be a 5.5 inch or something like that. Uh, but you also notice it does come equipped with suppressor height sights. Uh, and they're, I mean, they co witness well, so not a problem there. But yeah. You shot it with a can, and you could see, you could see the oh, you iron could, sights fine. Yeah. And that's, and that's a lot of the deal, too, is that you, I mean, your iron sights are your primary sights. I mean, those are primary. They're not secondary, they're primary. But. So yeah, overall, guys, get out there, shoot it. Your local ranges are going to start carrying these, um, but it's a good deal. Any more questions? Nothing popping up. Ooh, that's a good question. Uh, we've got uh, Simon says train. Will they sell the milled slides separately if you already own it in XDM? Boy, that's a good question. Good question and good idea. That's a great idea, actually. Uh, I'm not sure. Uh, again, they were kind enough just to send us this a little bit early. Um, and actually, we were running around today because we actually kind of thought it was launching a little bit later. And all of a sudden, we we're like, oh my gosh, we got we to gotta put this announcement out for you guys. Uh, but yeah. Mm, let's see. How does it feel pressing out on target 
with a red dot natural point of aim or do you have to search for it uh, for me um, what I find is that my natural point of aim it comes right in line because I bring my the gun up to my eyes um, I can find it relatively easy now I'm cross-eyed dominant and so it does take me just a little bit to get used to bringing that side up or my eye over um, so if you're cross-eyed dominant it'll probably take you a little bit but get out train with your red dots uh, because that's going to be the most important don't take your word for it like oh i got a red dot i'm good always train for it but anyway guys that's all we got man uh threaded barrel it's the xdm osp optical sight pistol uh, for you guys wanting to learn more head over to springfield armory's website and they'll answer all the questions for you too